President Trump cast himself as the ultimate friend of the troops, going so far as to say he's done more for America's military than anyone. But now a damning report in The Atlantic says the president disparaged American war dead during a 2018 visit to Paris. Sources told The Atlantic that President Trump called U.S. service members killed in battle losers and suckers as he tried to justify his decision to cancel a visit to a cemetery for Marines who died liberating France in World War I. The article said he went so far as to tell senior aides, why should I go to that cemetery? It's filled with losers. The president is lashing out at The Atlantic. No, it was a fake story written by a magazine that was uh, probably not going to be around much longer. The report came just three days after a political poll by the Military Times suggested the president's support among active duty military members is slipping. The poll of just over 1,000 troops said President Trump is viewed unfavorably by nearly 50 percent and that a slight plurality backs former Vice President Joe Biden. Atlantic editor Jeffrey Goldberg stood by his reporting, including these insights on why the president refused the cemetery visit during a rainstorm. I've heard from people in the Pentagon who, Marines, who are a bit insulted that the, the idea that the Marines couldn't fly a helicopter in the rain. But the, the larger point is, is that Donald Trump expressed directly to senior aides uh, his lack of desire to go to the cemetery uh, and not to risk 90 minutes in traffic uh, uh, it, because he doesn't understand why one would go pay that level of respect to fallen American soldiers. He also, by the way, expressed directly fear that the rain, which was quite heavy at times, would mess with his hair. Vice President Biden grew upset while talking about the troops. If these statements are true, the president should humbly apologize to every gold star mother and father and every blue star family that he's denigrated and insulted. Who the heck does he think he is? But the president has a history of disparaging statements about heroic soldiers, including the late Senator John McCain. In the article, President Trump is quoted as telling aides, we're not going to support that loser's funeral. That follows these comments in 2015. But, you know, he lost. So I never liked him as much after that, because I don't like losers. <laughs> but, but, Frank, he's Frank, let me get hero. to it. He's he a hit war me. Hero. He's not a war hero. He's a war hero. He's a war Five hero. And a half years he's a war hero because he was captured. I like people that weren't captured, okay? President Trump has attacked other military families, too, including the parents of Humayun Khan, though he signed a bill in 2018 to name a Virginia post office after him. For Newsy, I'm Peter Hecht.